Congratulations! If you're watching this video, it means you've earned your first digital badge. This tutorial will show you how to claim your badge and then display it on your digital portfolio. So what is a badge? Well, it's a visual representation of a skill or an achievement that you've earned. For example, if you were a scout, you may have earned a paddler's badge when you learned how to steer a canoe. Anyone who saw your sash would know that you earned that badge and it's something you can do. The digital badge is really the same thing, but now you can earn badges for almost anything and everything you learn, and then share it with everyone on your digital portfolio. In our previous challenge, you created a new page in your digital portfolio called Digital Badges. This is where we're going to host the badge you've just earned. First, you need to go to your school Gmail account and find the email from me. It will say Jennifer Fenton via Credly. Click on that message and open it. You will see the image of the badge you've earned. Scroll down and click on Save and Share. This will take you to the Credly site where you will be prompted to log in to Save and Share. Once you click on that, you'll see you need to create a new account. Please be sure to use your school email and your school password so that you can remember it for next time. Once you sign up, you have to go back to your Gmail and look for the email from Credly. Click on that email and there is a link to activate your account. You must go through this link to get your badge. You then log in using your email address as your username and the password that you just used and there you will see your new badge, the Digital Pioneer, in your dashboard. Click on the Accept button and this badge will go into um, your dashboard with all of your other badges. To display the badge in your digital portfolio, we need to be able to get the embed code. To do this, we need to make it public. Hover over the badge and you'll see a little icon of a closed eye. Click on it and the eye will open. This now makes it a public badge. Hover over the badge again and click on the Manage button. When you do that, it will become larger and you'll see up on the left hand side there's a little symbol or icon for the embed code. Click on that. Then click on the boxes to display the badge title and the issuer's names. And since we only have two badges, change the amount to two. Click on the small badges and then get embed code. Highlight all of this code and copy. Remember, control C. Now go back to your digital badges page on your portfolio. Click on edit and we're going to change the layout so that your badges display nicely. Select a three column layout um, because the badges aren't very big. Now we're putting in a code so you have to go up into your menu bar and select the HTML code. Click inside before the break and paste the code. Then say update. It will look like a gadget. Click on that and click on the gear icon. You could change the size if you wanted to, but we're quite happy with the way it's set up by default, so just say OK. I'm going to click on the center button and then press save. And voila, your new badges are in your digital portfolio. You will have many opportunities to earn more badges throughout the school year. Congratulations, you are really a digital pioneer. Thank you.